Welcome everyone to My AI Live. Today is Tuesday, July 2nd. We do have some housekeeping stuff to take care of super quick. Um, first of all, there is a, uh, so our Thursday meeting, the Thursday Justin, Adrian, Cheryl meeting is today instead because Thursday's 4th of July here in the U.S., so uh, they have the meeting today. Now they're going to be covering the announcement of video AI. So of course you won't want to miss that. Uh, there will, I believe there will be a replay if you can't make it, but you you surely don't want to miss that. Um, other announcements, we do not have a meeting for my AI live or any meetings on 4th of July. So uh, I was never good at taking a day off, and I'm actually taking a day off on the holidays, which is something that's not normal for me, and I'm learning how to do. I love what I do, but I've got a, uh, I've got the opportunity to spend time with friends, and, and I'm going to do that, so it's going to be wonderful. All right, um, so that's covered. Anybody brand new here today? Anybody brand new? If you are, put a one in the chat. Put a one in the chat if you're brand new. If you've been here before and you've learned some great things, please put some sevens in there for me so I know who you are. Got Mary and Bruce with sevens and Paul and Yolanta. Yolanta comes from Poland here. Like, goodness, we are international. So glad you're here, honey. That is just such an honor. Uh, look at all those. Fantastic. Oh, Diane, I have a number one. So it always helps me know when there's new people here. Fantastic. Well, let me explain to you how the meeting's going to go real quick. We do this every Monday through Friday at 11 a.m. Eastern Time, 8 a.m. Pacific. And what we do is we cover the My AI system, but we do a different type of demo every single day. The class is never the same, ever. And the reason for that is, is because there's so many different ways of building and so many different ways of starting conversations on social media. So we do a different type of demo every day. We go and take five minutes to go do the work ourselves. So we're helping you get consistent. For those of us, there's many of us who have been doing this kind of consistent work together for years. And it's really made a difference in our consistency. We come back, we have Q&A, we showcase some of the posts, we show your posts, and then we help you with what, uh, uh, you know, what we maybe tweak a post, do something a little different, answer your questions and things like that. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get started today. Um, now, on Tuesdays, some of the hashtags uh, that work really well on Tuesdays, Transformation Tuesday, especially if you are doing before and after pictures celebrating yourself or celebrating somebody else. Taco Tuesday, because everybody loves food pictures. Food and animals will get your algorithm going like crazy. I'm not kidding. You post funny animal things, or if you post funny pictures of Jennifer when she's looking at Steve, like, yeah, that was a great picture. Like funny, funny photos um, and those kinds of things. They, they'll get your algorithm up. So one of the problems we have is that if we have uh, kind of burnt out our list, our Facebook, or our Instagram or anything like that. And we've burnt it out by saying, you know, buy my product, buy my product, buy my product. You may be starting this with not a lot of eyes on your posts, right? And so one of the biggest problems is, is that you want to start getting engagement again. But if Facebook isn't showing your post to anybody, it's pretty difficult to get engagement. Would everybody agree? I mean, because Facebook is deciding the algorithm, right? So how do we overcome that? How do we start getting more eyes on our posts in general? So when we do make an offer or we do start talking more about our business, we actually have engagement with it. That's what we're going to cover today. So um, let me show you where you're going to get your replay, especially for Diane. And let me get that up here. So you have your, that was bizarre computer's doing funky stuff today and it's not user error um just in case adrian's with tom i want to tease him a little bit okay here we go all right here you go this is where you're going to find your replay ad it's the official corporate nail site group 
the official corporate announcement group. You want to make sure that you are a part of this group because this is where all of your announcements are going to be made, your replays, you're going to find them here, and, and just a lot of camaraderie from our community, right? We have a great community, especially here on My AI Live. We get together all the time. We're having fun. We're enjoying each other. Most of us come uh, almost every day, so come as many days as you can, and you'll become an expert in social media, but this is where you'll find everything, right? So now if you want to know more about me, my name is Elizabeth Larson. I am a personal business transformation coach. I am a teacher, trainer, speaker, author, uh, network marketing professional. I have been doing online business building and teaching people how to use social media to build relationships for over 10 years. It started off with websites and blogs and... Um, for a little essential oil company that's not so little and uh, just took off from there and it's given me a, quite the career over my last 10 years. So, um, and again, if you, all of my posts here are made with the My AI, okay? So if you ever want to understand how to use the My AI, come here. If you ever are trying to figure out what to do, you don't know what kind of post to do, come over here, screenshot one of mine, put it into the now site system, and you could do a make it your own. Feel free to use it. You're more than welcome to. And, um, you know, I encourage that. So let me go over here. For some reason, my now site just closed. And that was bizarre. So let's open it back up. Okay, so let's get started. And we're gonna have a shorter uh, demo today because I do have to get this turned over to Adrian and everybody, but here we go. We're gonna be, a, there's three things we do each day. We post on social media, we comment on posts and we start conversations, right? Now today we're talking about what happens if your algorithm is bad. So if you come over and you're starting over, I don't know what that thing's doing, okay. If you're starting over, you may not be seen on the news feed. That's a beautiful picture of you guys. So how do you change that? Well, one thing that you can do is food posts, before and after posts, especially something like a weight loss post um, and animal posts. All of those, anything funny, anything like that will really drive your algorithm a lot. So I'll show you one of mine that I did, and then I'll show you how we did it. So give me one second. A little further down than I thought it was. I had it set, and then my computer just, my thing just completely closed out. There we go. Okay. So for a Transformation Tuesday post, something like this, I made this with the now, now site system. And this got um, 86 likes, 37 comments. I still have comments to answer on this. But what it did more importantly was it got my algorithm up, which of course, I because of the conversations back and forth, and it got me great conversations through Messenger with people who didn't even say anything on this post, messaging me and asking me, how did I do that? Could I have a conversation about that? So any of your transformation pictures will do this, whether it's weight loss, when you talk about your business transformation, you talk about who you used to be. And so this photo right here um, showed my weight loss, essentially. I went from a person who really hated themselves and all of that to somebody who I love my life. I'm grateful and um, it just keeps getting better and better, right? So I made this right here with the now site system. Now, the way you can do this is either you can go get a collage thing and put all your photos together. That's what I would recommend. And as soon as you have that, then I would come over here and I would do a caption my image. So let me go ahead and show you the caption my image. I'm gonna upload the image. And the great thing is, is that the now site system is going to look and find uh, that image and look at it and all of that. And I want to show you how accurate this is. It's pretty great. Let me get my photo. Do, 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 do. Where are you? Da, 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 da. There you are. Okay. So when I put the photo in here, 
the nail site system is going to look at all of that, right? It's going to look at the photo, it's going to examine it, and then it's going to write a post on it. Now, if I don't put anything on here, it will base its post just on what it sees in the video, okay? Uh -huh. I'm going to go ahead and mute you, Diane, but please feel free to raise your hand if you have a question. Okay, so I'm going to show you the difference between this. When I don't do anything at all, it's going to look at the photo and it's going to give me a post. Then I can, and I can actually put words in here of what I basically wanted to say if I want. Now, let's see what it does on its own because I want you guys to see the power of this, okay? Feeling so inspired by this amazing transformation, 70 pounds gone and the, a world of confidence gained. This journey is proof that change is possible with determination and self-love. Ready to take control of your life too? Let's embark on the incredible path together. Love this. Okay, and, and notice everybody, this is the thing that's so important that I wanted to get across to you today. First of all, so many, so many times we think we have to know what to write. We don't. So if you have like a funny video about a pet or you have a transformation photo, you have pictures of yummy food, especially Taco Tuesday. Everybody does Taco Tuesday. I miss those. Adrian and all of us of the team used to do tacos on Tuesdays. And um, so any of those kinds of things, right? So I'm going to come over here to Instagram to do the post on Instagram today since I already have this one on Facebook. It's going to be put together just a little bit different. Feeling beyond inspired by this incredible transformation, 70 pounds lighter, brimming with confidence. This journey shows how determination and self-love, anything is possible. Ready to seize control of your life too? Let's embark on this amazing path together. Okay, I'm going to hit get started. And the sim simplest thing that you can do is just post it the way it is. Now, you can add things in here. I can actually add some things in here. Let's embark on the... Uh, uh, I could go add some white space. Ready to get real results in your life. Let's embark on this path together. Okay. And I can put the white space in here. I can actually change all of this in here and then I can get started again. So I don't necessarily have to download the photo because I already have the photo in my computer. And let's go ahead and hit create. Select from computer. Now, when I hit open, I can add another photo here if I want to. I don't want to, and I'm just going to leave it like this, right? So I can go one to one. I can go four to five, or I can go 16 by 19, right? And put it that way. And then hit next. Hit next. I can paste in exactly what I put in there just the way. And remember, I edited it. I edited it. it, it not say that word uh right in here all right i hit share and it is done right okay perfect so let's go ahead and take five minutes we're going to go ahead and do our post now again you can do whatever kind of post you want maybe you're a pet parent and you have funny pictures of your pet those work really well to get your algorithm up. Transformation photos work very well as well. Uh, funny faces. Steve, um, I'll show Steve's real quick. He's actually not on here today, but I'll give you one more idea of kind of posts that, um, that do really well when you're trying to get your algorithm up. Okay. All right. Okay. Where is it? He's been working a lot on his Facebook. 
Okay, so we even made a reel of it, and everybody knows Jennifer on here. Jennifer, wave hi to everybody if you're on camera, honey. There she is. Okay, so he even made a reel of it. Now, here's the thing right here. This one is a lot of fun, right? So these kinds of things uh, can uh, get a lot of things going as well. So let's take five minutes. We're going to go ahead and do our post today. And again, this is about conversations. You're not trying to just sell your product just straight from the beginning. You're trying to start conversations with people. And this is one unique way of starting conversations. So let's take the five minutes. We're going to go ahead and do that. We'll come back for questions, maybe showcase a couple of posts, and then we will um and then we'll wrap this up and get this back over to Adrian and the team so they can show you all about the new video. And I'm going to check the chat for questions and see if there are any questions here. Yes. Okay. Um, so hopefully I pronounced your name right. Is it Rosario? Rosario? I hope that's correct. So the question is, do you see value in tweaking some of the responses from my AI as your own where it does not get 100% perceived as pure AI content. Uh, so two things I would say about that. First of all, the more you start using the program, the more it actually starts sounding like you. That's number one. And you want to make sure that you are coming over here. And I'm going to come over to the program right here. And if you continuously give it more content, it's always uh, learning as you're posting, as you're asking kinds of posts and things like that. But if you scroll down here to train my AI, the AI is going to uh, go based off of this information and what it's learned, what you've asked for and edited in the AI. So you wanna make sure that you have as much information in here as possible, your entrance and figures and things like this. Now. If it's not sounding 100% like you, first of all, it does take a little bit to train it at first. I did find that. But the second thing is sometimes it will go a little bit rogue and it'll start using some slang or some other things that isn't quite you or anything like that. There's a very simple fix to that. If you come over here to writing style, like when it started using some slang that I'm like, ah, that doesn't sound like me. I went over to formal just clicked one over this way, hit save, and then it was perfect. The second thing is, is that I always um, encourage adding some of your own content in there. So if you feel comfortable writing, you can tell a little bit more about your story, a little bit more about, um, especially when you're talking about your business or your product or your own experience and stuff like that. We had a great training yesterday when we were talking about that, about adding a little bit more of your own story in there. Because if you add a little bit more of your own story in there, you are actually going to be able to uh, connect with people a lot better. So yes, the question, the answer is yes, I do see value in tweaks. I usually do do some tweaks within my own posts and I hope that uh, helps you a lot. Okay. Uh, uh, fantastic. Okay. When people comment on a post I do, I made, do I use reply to comment or comment on posts? Okay. Perfect. PJ, let's go over to that one next. So let's kind of talk a little bit about commenting on posts. I'm going to share my screen here. So I have a whole bunch of comments to do on this post. So one of the questions that always comes is, well, which part of the NowSite program do I use to, um, to respond to somebody's comment? Okay. If you come over here to comment on post, it's asking you for the post. And that is this right here. So that would be you commenting on this. But how do you comment on something like this? 
What I like to do is go like this, and then I come over here to help me reply. And I put friendly chat, no business, new chat, and then just type the thing in there and then use the help me reply. I find that this actually is more accurate to what I want to say than trying to make it be the post. So thank you. Feeling fired up and ready to crush it. How can I help you channel your inner badass today? I love this. And Steve will love that too. So I'm going to come over here. And I'm going to, where's my post? There it is. So I love the post. I come over here to reply. And then I hit that. And then I put that in there. And so, PJ, that is how I would do it personally. If I'm going to comment on, on somebody's post in the feed, so if I come over here to the feed, isn't that beautiful? Okay, so PJ, I'm going to comment on your post now. You ready for that? I'm going to come over here and I'm going to comment, or I'm going to copy this. I'm going to put it into the nail site program. I'm going to come over here to comment on post. I'm going to put the text in the post here. I'm not going to say what I want. I could say specifically the type of comment I want, but I just want you to see what the AI will do. And when I do that, I said, here it is, the comment. I can copy the clipboard. Now, the post says, Wicket, my adorable puppy truly has the light. With plenty of warm snuggles, countless uh, place uh, sessions, and tasty treats galore. He's living his best life. How adorable is that? Okay, so I'm going to come over here. I'm going to like her post. And then I'm going to comment like that. Okay, perfect. So that is how I would comment up on a post, and that's how I would comment on a comment. Did that make sense? Perfect. Perfect. All right. Yeah, it does. Thank you. Wonderful. Ariel, are you available? So hard when people are off camera. Okay, Pamela, let's go over to you until I know Ariel's available. Uh, good question, because I have a hard time um, replying on in, uh, LinkedIn. How do you copy from LinkedIn? Because um, it's not letting me copy when somebody um comment on a post so i'm I not know if i have a problem with and then that. see what's going on. okay um let's go ahead and share screen hmm. all right so you want to comment on their post or on their no. comment on their comment. On their comment. Okay, let's find one with a comment. Mom? Okay, here's some comments. All right. Comments. Gotta find the comments. My computer's running so slow. Ooh, what the heck's going on? Okay. All right. Hmm. Why? I'm sorry, my computer, I don't know what the heck is going on. Things are just doing whatever they want. Okay. Copy. Come over to the nail site and go to help me reply. 
I'm sorry, my computer is running so bad. I have no idea what's going on. Oh my goodness. All right, this is gonna be the last thing I do today because we've got to wrap up and I don't. Okay, so anyways, I can copy from there. I have no idea what the problem might be, but I can do it, uh, Pamela. All right, I have a hard stop, you guys. I have to get this back over to Adrian, Diana. Uh, um, I'll get with you and answer your question um, after this. Or, and I'm sorry, guys, I have no idea. My computer's like freezing and freaking out. So what happened? I don't know if it's my internet or what. I apologize, everybody. Okay, so let's go ahead and wrap up here. I love you guys. I hope you have a wonderful day. And I will see you guys tomorrow on my AI Live at 11 a.m. Eastern Time, 8 a.m. Pacific. Uh, have a great day, everybody. I don't even know if you guys can hear me. I've lost everything on my computer. We can hear you. So sorry, guys. I have no idea. I've been having, this thing's been freaking out all day. I think it's time for a new computer. Okay. All right. Restart. 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 Love you. Hey, hey, only so many energy. times I can restart it. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Love you guys, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Bye. 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 Posted, sweetheart. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's so crazy.